Right, so we are at it again, Bryce. Uh, freshly charged the battery up. Got the engine turning over now, which we know. Uh, the switch is doing something it's not supposed to be doing, but we'll deal with that. Um, so we're going to sort the switch out first. We'll have a look. We'll see if we can run power directly to the coil and see if it'll start. That's the aim for the day. If it doesn't, I don't know what I'm going to do. So let's crack on. Get this switch sorted. Well, I'm going to undo this push start switch and see if when I turn the key then it still turns over. It doesn't. So, so we know there's a problem with that switch, which is that's a good thing. So we'll scrap that switch. And we did suss out that the old switch just wasn't working at all. But I'm just going to quickly reconnect that to double check that. No, so the old switch is buggered. So, what I'll do, I'll see if I've got another little switch I can just put on there or make a switch of some kind. Ah, fucking bastard, cunt, fuck. Oh, that's alright, it's only my head. Right, I've got some switches somewhere. Right, some. Okay. Now we've got to find. Uh, I'm going to have a look first. Just double check whether we have got. Make sure we haven't got power going to this wire. Oh, didn't know they came off. Well, that's good. Right, so I'll put that in there. Let's check that on the battery first. Battery's reading 12.68, so we know we've got this meter set up right. What I am a bit concerned about is I've, I've put the old ignition system back on, and there's nothing connected to the earth wire I don't know whether that is I think it's earth through the body but right let's turn that ignition on Ooh. which I can't do now can I right so we'll have to put the right We'll just hook them up together. Oh shit. There it is. So I'm just going to short the ignition switch. So it should just go back on. Okay. thought we've got no power going to the coil 
so we'll trace that coil wire back Now the stupid problem I got is that's the only bit of auto wire I got which is not long enough to reach from the coil to the live on the battery so um, I suppose I could split it Okay, so we'll look one end of this into the live side, which I don't know which the live side is now. Alright, hopefully we'll touch this to the live and it won't go bang. Oh fuck, sparks coming from it. So I'm saying Is that because I've wired that up wrong? Oh, I don't know now. I'll just give it a try, fuck it. I'm just going to shove it in there. Oh, there's nothing smoking, so... Well, Bryce. This is good news. I've got a spark on this spark plug. That is good news. Right, so what I'm going to do, I've got that into there. I'm going to put that back on the plug that's already in there. stupid thing I did last time with the petrol although should still have petrol in the carb I think but okay I'm gonna give it some more I'll tell you what if this don't start after this I'm just about ready to give up so wish me luck Try and get something's bleeping there. I don't like bleeping. <coughs> okay. We've got sparks at the spark plug. The engine's turning over. Let's do it. Whoa. Whoa, Brian.
running. Wow. Wow. Okay, so... I know what I've got to do now. Loosen that distributor. Because the timing is right out, obviously. So we'll loosen that a bit. Try that again. Okay, Bryce. Let's try and start her up again. That is a huge win. Um, there we go, we've got the engine running, so next week we're going to crack on, start getting it all back together. Yes. Oh, yes. Right, Bryce, thanks for joining me today. Uh, I'm going home to crack open a bottle of Jack Daniels. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday, or whatever day you're watching this. And we'll have this on the road within the next few weeks. See you next time. Don't forget to subscribe. Stay tuned to it now because she's running. And hit the bell notification. Keep up to date with what's going on now. See you next time.